As the special CBI court in Rouse Avenue reserves its order on Satendra Jain's bail application in relation to the money laundering case registered against him by the ED. Neelashish, I, I believe, is now joining us for more on this. Well, yes, Pinesh, startling statement coming in from Satyendra Jain. In fact, today, the Enforcement Directorate uh, during Satyendra Jain's bail hearing informed the court that uh, they confronted him with documents regarding one uh, Lala Sher Singh Trust, where apparently he was the president and showed him his signatures. Uh, Satyendra Jain apparently told the Enforcement Directorate that he never knew anything about the trust and his signatures needed to be matched. Uh, when he was questioned further, he said, I have lost my memory due to COVID and uh, thereafter I, I have uh, difficulty remembering things. So, of course, a very, very uh, intriguing statement coming in from Satyendra Jain. Uh, of course, this was mentioned by the Enforcement Directorate while opposing Satyendra Jain's uh, bail application in the Rouse Avenue court today. And uh, the court has, in fact, now reserved its order. Also, the Enforcement Directorate did say that they're already inter interrogating him. The probe is still ongoing and therefore they oppose his bail application saying that it could uh, hinder the probe if Satyendra Jain was uh, allowed to go out on bail. Satyendra Jain yesterday, let's not forget, was sent to 14 days judicial custody by the same court. The order on his bail application will be pronounced on the 18th of June. Of course, the BJP has been mocking the Delhi minister after he said it's amnesia caused by COVID, that he doesn't remember what happened. Not something which is plausible as per the BJP. Thank you so much. Keep tracking the developments on that front, Neelashi.